Ireland has seen a rise in sexually transmitted diseases such as HIV, syphilis, gonorrhea, herpes and chlamydia in 2017. Chlamydia remains Ireland's dominant STI, with high levels of herpes and gonorrhea also being confirmed. We spoke to Welfare and Equality Officer Podge Henry on what students can do to take care of their sexual health. So if you put your sexual health and stay safe, as I would use it's like obviously the first protocol is use con- con- contraception when engaging in sexual activity, and that's what the SU is here for. So we have you know f- um, free condoms, we have lubricant, we have dental dams, um, and then also um, we have provided free STI checks for all students on campus in both Glass Nevin and St Pat's. And in order to get a free STI check, you literally just have to go into the the health centre and book one and they're very fast, they're, they're two minutes, it's only a swab, there's no, it's only a swab um, yeah. and since last year we've actually been able to secure more STI checks, so last year there would have been a certain time in the, towards the end of semester one and all of semester two, whereas this year it was all academic year and there's actually been a reduce in uh, uh, positive STIs since last year, so hopefully we like to, hopefully we like to think that we've kind of contrib- contributed to that by raising awareness. 2017 saw 6,975 cases of STIs, which is a 13.8% increase over 2015. Public health experts warned that early detection is key to effective treatment. According to these experts, Tinder, Grindr and other dating apps has led to the rise in the trend. Syphilis, which was once reduced to minimal levels, has witnessed a worrying re-emergence since 2011. Helen O'Neill, DCU-TV News.